Yeah, we got it. Got him? Oh, dropped oh, it. Hit. Got a hit. That was halfway up, eh? Yep. There we go. Got him out. Yep. There you go. Yeah, that's more like it. <laughs> hey! Oh, beautiful stuff. All right. All this right. is more like what we're chasing. Yeah. It should be a yellow-tailed kingfish. Yeah, you'd say so. Uh, it could, could be a Samson, but could be a, yeah, we'll yeah. have a look. Certainly, uh, he's certainly got some so go, whatever oh, it is. Oh, let's just hope he stays off the reef. He's taking a lot of line. He is. Oh, this is scary. Now, you got uh, 30 pound braid. 30 pound braid, yeah. 60 pound leader. Yep. Which is pretty light for a decent king. It is. So, it is, uh, but it's good fun. Yeah, <laughs> yeah if we get him, it's good fun. <laughs> yeah. He's certainly bumping his head round like a king, isn't he? Yeah. yeah. Is you a brave man using 30 pound brave when you know there's <laughs> possibly kingfish to 20 kilos yeah. or more here? I mean, yep. the, the range is from about 6 to 20 kilos. This it is, is I'd pretty say this, much. I'd say this is better than a 6 kilo fish, oh, okay. if it is a kingfish. Um, Alan called it for kings as we drifted over the top. In fact, Paul, when we first got here, saw a patch on the sounder, and it's the only, it's the only time it's come back under the boat and he's hooked up. He'd have to be 15 to 20 kilos. That's a cracker. Great. On a, on a yeah. <laughs> such a light spinning out that you. Yeah. He's caught some good fish on that. He's oh, told yeah. me, but this, would this top it? This, this is the biggest fish I caught on this reel. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> no worries. That is yeah. a sensational yellowtail kingfish. Fantastic eating. Great fighting fish, as you saw. Yep. And we're gonna feed the guys back at the Le Grand Hotel ten times over with this guy. They are really good eating fish. On a jig, that's one of the biggest I've seen on a jig for a long time, yeah, mate. Good fun on jig, yeah. <laughs> Well done, Alan York. A quick run back to our mark, and it was the bait line singing this time. Very exciting stuff here. Part of my job's tackle testing, and I've got the big Selena 2 rod out, and the big Selena 2 1600 reel, and I had a big bait on, and this fish has just woken up. Oh, I hope it's another kingy, but basically I've got a big running sinker rig, and the boys had some, some herring from the other day, about that big, and whatever's grabbed and swallowed it whole. Albany definitely has snapper covered. There's red, queen, and these guys, the pink snapper. All great sports and table fish. Just net him if you can there, mate. Yep. Got him. Yeah, got him, yeah. <laughs> nice, what a surprise. Nice snapper, Rob. <laughs> What they call a pink snapper. Pink snapper, he's a beauty too. They live in the southern half of Australia and he's a, he's a good one. Now that is a prime table fish. Yeah, he's it just fish. keeps getting better down here. He took, took a whole herring that we caught earlier on the beach. That's oh, a good you know, solid pinky, that one. Yeah, it's about 85 centimetres yeah. long and I reckon probably about five kilo mark thereabouts. Yep. yep. Prime table fish. Absolutely. Good fight. No match for the big gear I had on there. When you got them on a short string and you give them some, they really show their power. But uh, got him up. Got another prime table fish. Jeez, uh, I'll tell you what. <laughs> Good job. Tell you what, Albany, not too bad, eh? Mm -hmm.